Prince Harry and Meghan Markle could come up against two major roadblocks when planning future tour without royal help, an expert has warned. The Sussexes have just come off the back of a four-day trip to Colombia, which was dubbed a DIY royal tour after it had all the hallmarks of an official royal visit. It saw them visiting schools, enjoying musical performances, speaking at forums, meeting Invictus Games competitors and even learning how to play the drums during their events in Bogota, Cartagena and Cali. It also follows a similar trip to Nigeria back in May, where they carried out similar engagements. And according to royal expert and historian Dr. Tessa Dunlop, the Sussexes can't pretend it is easy work, especially without the support of the monarchy when planning these visits. She explained, the Sussexes' recent visit to Colombia confirmed what we already knew, Harry is most comfortable doing what he was trained for from birth, glad-handing, gushing, ribbon-cutting, dancing, and even trying his hand Spanish. Dubbed the DIY Royal Tour, the Sussexes have found their sweet spot visiting countries, Colombia, Nigeria, in need of an international uptick. So far so good. But let's not pretend that this is easy work. Megan wriggled in and out of 11 designer outfits in four days. Previously the Duchess has been known to use Adele's stylist and this trip's wardrobe had all the hallmarks of a professional overhaul. The couple were guests of Colombia's vice president and full security was provided, but without support from the British monarchy planning trips like these is time-consuming and expensive. And to keep their brand on point the Sussexes need to keep delivering. Tessa also pointed out how different the past few weeks have been for the Sussexes when compared to those of the Prince and Princess of Wales, with William and Kate scoring a clear ace with an appearance lasting just seconds. She explained, back in Britain, beyond a couple of glory monuments at Trooping and Wimbledon, William and Kate have had an understandably quiet summer. Yet all it took from the Prince and Princess of Wales was one brief Instagram appearance alongside the real star of the Olympics, USAS Snoop Dogg, for the couple to slam dunk the season with a clear ace. William surprised with stubble and Snoop Dogg signed off on behalf of the Prince and his lovely wife, royal fans swooned. Even my teenage daughter mustered vague interest, this was royalty's own version of Brett Summer. William and Kate will cap off the season with a trip to Scotland's Balmoral, a cheering sign in the wake of the Princess of Wales's earlier cancer diagnosis. Behind castle walls, Kate will be well looked after by the royal institution she has come to personify. But still on the outside is her brother-in-law Harry. There is no word of his arrival, presumably, the freelance prince will be too busy planning the Sussexes' next big move.